Hello everyone, good day. Welcome to the Academy for Digital Learning and Mastery Studio, ADLM. My name is Adidola Pokozi. I am the team lead and founder of ADLM Studios. ADLM Studio is a point surveying training academy where we deal with training of point surveyors and construction cost estimators on how to make use of point surveying softwares, BIM tools. We also deal with developing of various QS softwares and plugins such as you've seen in our, on this channel, such as the ADLM Plan Swift plugin, ADLM Revit plugin, and many more. Today, I come to you to present to you our new class coming up April 5th, 2025. This title, the title of this class is Integrating BIM, AI, and Data Analytical Tools into your workflow as a point surveyor. Yes, I'm sure many point surveyors seeing this now will be like, how do they integrate all of this together? With our plugins, We've seen how your workflow go from 60 to 70%, 80% margin. Now, with the help of all of these tools, it takes your workflows to at least 90% advantage because all of these tools will make your work faster, digitized, and more efficient. As coin surveyors, I'm sure many of us will be like, what is our role in the BIM workflow? Basically, BIM means building information for Delhi. In the course of this program, we'll be learning how to work with the 4D, 5D, and 6D aspect of BIM. All of this you will learn in depth during the course of this program. You also learn how to make use of BIM tools such as Revit, Plant Swift, Navisworks, and MS Project. I'm sure you'll be wondering how do you make use of all of this? We're looking at how to navigate the Autodex Revit software, understanding your 3D model as a code surveyor. When it comes to BIM, we have different Dimension, the BIM dimension, that's the way down to you know, the aspect down to six is all we covered during the course of this program. So, we'll be looking at how to navigate the 3D models, how to work with 3D models. We'll also look at how to fill up our sheets with various um, models, that's the various views on your models. Then, we'll also look at how to make use of the collaborate tab. Then, the use of collaborate tab, you understand work sharing, how to collaborate with your fellow colleagues. Copy and, copy and monitor various levels on your project, how to add coordination review and check for inter interface check also. So we'll check all of this during the course of the program. We we'll also look at um, how to make use of Navisworks. So Navisworks, we'll go into Navisworks in details, navigating your 3D models, understanding all your views, creating your own federated models. So with federated models, you can easily check for various elements within the building. See with this Ravis work model, this sample model that will be used in the class. See you have your mechanical model selected. So we selected this mechanical view. We see how you are able to create your own federated model like this and, and do various views in your building your building here. So we also have this you can check out the electrical view also. So for this is just mechanical model. You see how the pipe works, HVAC channels, your pipe accessories and all that. We we'll check all of this during the course of the class. Also, we'll explain the timeliner, quantification, and class detectives. Also, we'll cover all of this during the course of the program. How to make use of Navisworks for class detection, how to use the timeliner function. The timeliner function works with MS Project, we will also discuss in class. Prepare detailed program of work like this. Then we'll prepare our resource sheets. How do you manage resources across the lifespan of projects? How do you manage various stages of the project? All of this will be covered during the course of this class. So, it is a class you don't want to miss. Hold on. Then we'll cover Plan Swift also, how to make use of Plan Swift for your quantity takeoff, how to prepare detailed quantity takeoff, see that we have various quantities as we mentioned here, how to use Plan Swift for your quantity takeoff and easy quantity takeoff. So your quantity takeoff can now be merged to your Excel sheet, POQ preparation and all of that will be looked at during the course of this program. So basically we we'll look at POQ preparation, material shedding preparation, program of work preparation, updating your 3D, collaborating with various colleagues, for example those of us that work in um, a complete BIM environment where we have an in-house architect and structural engineer. You can always share your links, how to openly collaborate and create your own work set and work with your own work set. Your own work set as a QS will be whatever you're working on as a QS will be saved in your own work set. You create your own takeoff views and do your point takeoff with Revit. All of this will be covered during the course of this program. This program is meant to go straight to the point to teach you how to implement all of these softwares into your workflows directly. How you use Revit for your point takeoff, analyze your 3D designs, and work in the collaborative environment with your design team. 
how to interpret drawings from Revit and all others. Also, look at how to make use of Plant Swift and include your information from Plant Swift into your Revit model, that's your 3D model. As we said, building information modeling, we are building information. So instead of our previous workflow where we prepare our bills of quantities and isolation, as a quantity surveyor, also, I'll also be putting you through how to use, prepare your bills of quantities and now integrate them into the BIM environment where you have a digital bill and others. This class titled BIM, AI and Data Analysis we we'll also be using AI tools to make your workflow faster. AI tools such as ChatGPT will also be used during the course of this program. In terms of data analysis, we'll be making use of Power BI in collaboration with Python R and other data analytical tools. ADLM in collaboration with Synth Analysis in this year 2025, we'll be taking our entire BIM course to the next level. For those that have been enrolled for this program before, trust me, it is nothing like you've ever seen at ADLM. Because this is ADLM in collaboration with QS Victor Color for of Synth Analysis. As two point surveyors, one specialized in BIM and AI, and the other specialized in data analysis. Trust me, it's nothing like you've ever seen before. Let's get from Victor Color for himself. Hello everyone. I am Victor Color by name. I'm the founder of Synth Analytics, a fast-growing data analytics startup that focuses on providing data analytics solution. As a construction expert, you are no stranger to the challenge of managing complex projects, tight deadlines, and budget constraints. But have you ever stopped to think about the one thing that can give you a competitive edge in this fast-paced industry? What if you can use Revit or Bluebeam to create taking off structured data via exporting in CSV so as to be able to import the same into Power BI and build a dynamic bill of quantity and commercial dashboard for deeper insights. Data analytics is the name oil that construction professionals must leverage to get better results. By harnessing the power of the data, you can make informed decisions, optimize project performance, and drive business growth. But how do you get started? ADLM Studio, in partnership with Synthanatics, has organized a training program tag integration of BIM, AI, and data analytics into content surveying workflow. Synthanatics will be training on the skill you need to prepare commercial dashboard using Excel, Power BI, integrating of bill of quantities into your Power BI for cost and visualization, and to automate your reports. In this training, you stand to learn how to prepare your commercial dashboard using your Excel and Power BI, how to integrate your bill of quantity into Power BI for project cost visualization, how to integrate your material schedule in, into Power BI for monitoring and tracking, also how to automate your daily reporting on Power BI. Don't let data overwhelm you. Join this training program and discover how data analysis can transform your career as a quantity surveyor, including how to prepare your approximate estimates and how to predict at what your future cost will be. Register now for our training program and take the first step towards unlocking your power of data analytics in your quantity surveying career. Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your career and stand out in the competitive world. As Victor has said, it's going to be an amazing one as you also learn to prepare your dashboards. Yes, so during the course of this program, it is expected that at the end of this class, you will be able to make use of not just BIM tools, but even AI and data analytical tools. By the time you are presenting your bills of quantities to your clients, you don't just present PDF spreadsheets that many clients may not eventually look at. You present your bills of quantity dashboard, your cost dashboard, and your material dashboard to your client. With this dashboard, it takes your work to the next level and it will analyze quantity takeoff and builds of what it is. This class is co starts first week of April as 5th of April and it's a weekend course Friday, Saturday, Sunday in the evening and each section is for two hours. So over six weeks we'll be looking at all of GIM, AI and data analytical tools. It's going to be a very interactive class. It's going to be a wonderful one. Why not enroll today? Click on the link in the description of this video 
to fill your form and begin your enrollment process. I can't wait to see you in class. Have a lovely day. Bye.